one of our most favourite stretches of single track. Nothing very difficult, just a few reasonably technical sections. Some cruisy stuff, and all of it in good old fashioned Aussie bush. It's only my fourth dirt ride since I fractured my spine, so I am sitting as much as possible, which makes it an interesting experiment to see if I can keep up with Jeff, who of course is free to stand and sit whenever he wants. After riding so much snotty terrain the last few years, we figured some relatively easy stuff would make a pleasant change. As usual, Jeff is on the Beta RR300 and I am on the Beta Cross Trainer. I still get plenty of requests for reviews about both bikes. Look, we both really like our Betas, but I don't want to do any reviews while this crazy problem with main bearing failures continues. They are genuinely good bikes, but the Beta factory has really dropped the ball over this issue. It took a lot of pressure to make them even acknowledge the main bearing failures, then more pressure to make them respond appropriately. And then they changed their story about what the cause was, they claim it was fixed, then the problem continued anyway. If the main bearings are definitely fixed for the 2021 models, we might eventually do some beta reviews. At least it's still a relatively small number of cases. And of course, every manufacturer has various issues of their own. Our general opinion is all the European two-strokes are brilliant bikes. And of course, the bikes are much better than most of us will ever be. So just choose your favorite color. And of course, don't pay too much. KTMs are ridiculously expensive, at least here in Australia. It's no wonder so many are refusing to pay obnoxious prices for a pumpkin and are going for Shirkos and Betas instead. Or <laughs> waiting for Riehu to revive the original oh. Gas Gas brand again. Stuff that up. Cannot wait. Oh, get out. Bloody sticks. The final part of the track and its pivot turns all the way. I usually stand to do these pivot turns, so this will be weird sitting on the seat all the way up. That's weird sitting down. Uh, well, it's a down trail, that one. Yeah. Hope you enjoyed the ride, guys. Remember, if you're into dual sport or adventure riding, we are posting new vids over on our adventure channel. Catch you later.